Hey guys, welcome back to Film Visionary. Today we'll talk about 7 YouTubers who are on TV. Let's head into it. Number 10, Zoella on the Great British Bake Off. Vlog is fashion and makeup, so to, to stray into other territory was pretty brave. Yeah, it was quite scary. You know we couldn't make a list about YouTubers on TV without including our very own Zoe Sugg. Zoe's been everywhere, this morning, Loose Women, News Round, but our favorite by far is definitely when she appeared on the Great British Bake Off as a part of Comic Relief. Having to outbake the likes of Jonathan Ross, Ross, Abby Clancy, and Gok Wan in order to win. We saw Zoe bake delicious looking banana and salted caramel cupcakes, profiter rolls, and a beach house themed marble cake. It all looked so good. Our stomachs were rumbling throughout the entire special. While Zoe didn't win the overall competition, we demand a recount, and nearly killed Barry Barry. We feel our time on GBBO was pretty spectacular and we hope they have her back again for a rematch. Number 9, Hannah Witten on Love Fix. Who better to host a show about love, sex, and relationships than someone who is an entire YouTube channel dedicated to the subject? It looks like ITV execs were thinking the same thing as they only got the one and only Hannah Witten to co-present Love Fix. The show, which aired this February, saw Hannah and co-host Katie McGrew, Ollie Locke, and comedian Kojo to try to solve the nation's romantic dilemmas. Quite the feat, really, including some things that were not safe for work. The show was honestly the perfect fit for Hannah, and we really hope they make it an annual thing. Our love lives are a mess, and we need some help fixing them. Number 8, Jim Chapman on Virtual Tap. We really wish we could turn back time to the good old days when our mama sang us to sleep and Jim Chapman was on Viral Tap. What, not as good as the original? Fine, but you have to admit, you totally miss Viral Tap. The show saw Jim, along with a whole host of co-representers, looking at various viral videos and participating in some hilarious banter. We saw him really come into his own on the show and grab hold of that charming confidence we see from him today. Luckily for us, Jim's still presenting, as he was recently the host of GQ UK's new series, Luxury of Less. Number 7, PG Liguri and Chris Kendall on Good Day LA. Last autumn was certainly a whirlwind for PG Liguri and Chris Kendall, who were out promoting PJ's new, and insanely awesome series, Oscars Hotel. And no, we're not just talking about newspaper interviews. We're talking about appearing on major US TV shows, such as Access Hollywood and Good Day LA. Look at them, chilling with the bigwigs. Honestly, we were so proud of the two after watching their interviews. We felt like mama birds watching their children fly away from the nest for the first time. Okay, okay, enough of the mushy stuff, but you have to admit, them appearing on US TV is pretty damn cool. Number 6, Jack Howard and Dean Dobbs on Virtually Famous. You know what's better than having celebrities on quiz shows? Having YouTubers compete on them, especially when said YouTubers are the hilarious comedy duo Jack Howard and Dean Dobbs. We here at 1080HQ love Virtually Famous, so when we heard that Jack and Dean would be appearing on the panel, we couldn't even watch. We even had a party to celebrate, complete with finger foods and fancy glasses of champagne. You might think that's going a bit far, but you honestly don't know our love for this show or for Jack and Dean. Number 5, Dan Howell on the Super Gamers. 10,000 gamers are dragging their computers into an underworld of convention halls. Here's what we've gathered over the past few years, that the BBC loved Dan Howell, and honestly how could they not? Just look at that fringe, the way he smiles, those brown eyes, but we're getting off track. In 2015, Dan teamed up with the BBC to present The Super Gamers, a documentary about the world of professional video gaming. The ultimate life goal for quite a few of us, if we're being honest. The documentary saw Dan follow three professional gamers as they competed in gaming competitions like Dreamhack with the ultimate aim of learning the secrets of professional gaming. We think he did a pretty good job. Now, Number 4, Jamie Pine and Mike Jerry on Rich Kids Go Shopping. What's television without a little controversy? It makes for good TV, and Channel 4's Rich Kids Go Shopping, which featured Jamie Pine and his fiance Mike Jerry, sure stirred up some. The title basically sums up what the documentary was about. Cameras followed rich kids as they shop. Jamie and Mike's appearance on the special brought about a lot of negativity toward the two, with many viewers criticizing Mike for spending Jamie's money and inquiring as to how Jamie acquired his funds. Jamie eventually set the record straight, but hey, good TV supposed to bring about conversation, right? Despite all the controversy, the documentary ended with Jamie's proposal to Mike, which we think was totally adorbs. Number 3, Oil White Jimmy Hill and Mawan Rizwan on Disney XD. Online superstar, Mr. Oli White! What's cooler than being taught the coolest life hacks? Having Oli White, Jimmy Hill, and Mawan Rizwan teach them to you, of course. 
Oli, Jimmy, and Moan teamed up with Disney XD to present Mega Awesome Super Hacks, a show aimed at presenting the most incredible hacks for the most epic situations. Whether you're interested in learning how to survive the next Ice Age, or want to become the best spy on your block, these guys have got some tips for you. Surprisingly, they all work. It's Mega Awesome. Number 2. Casper Lee and Joey Sugg on Alan Carr, Chatty Man Yes, we know the condom challenge is a thing of the past, and oh boy are we thankful it is. But did you know that Casper Lee and Joey Sugg once teamed up with Chatty Man's Alan Carr for an attempt? While we might be tired of the challenge, we have to admit that Joey and Casper's appearance on Chatty Man was pretty funny. After a few failed attempts which had us and the audience in stitches, the trio were eventually able to successfully complete the challenge, resulting in applause all around. Number 1. Beef and Leedy and Jimmy Hill on 4 Music we all know that Beef and Leadly and Jimmy Hill are massive fans of music, but did you know that the two have teamed up with 4Music to bring it to the masses? Jimmy is a presenter for the channel and Bethan has her own show, titled to the UK Music Video Chart, where she counts down the most 20 played music videos on YouTube. To be honest, we're pretty jealous of them both. Imagine getting to talk about music all day. Must be amazing. Better yet, imagine if we had our own show where we talked about YouTube. Now that's the dream. This brings us to the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit like if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss any of our videos in the future. Also, watch the two videos that are on your screen because I'm sure you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.